Some people will say, well, couldn't the universe be expanding, but not from nothing? Maybe it's expanding and contracting cyclically, and we just happen to be in an expansion period right now, which makes it look like the universe came from nothing, but it could be contracted and then expanding again. The problem, of course, is that the science does not help their case because there's not enough mass and gravitational forces to cause the, the, the actual. As a matter of fact, the universe is not slowing down in its expansion so it can recollapse. It's actually speeding up in its expansion. Or maybe we've got an issue, but maybe there's a larger eternal environment. By the way, everyone. Atheists and theists alike are looking for the first eternal cause of the universe. Have you ever had anyone say to you, well, if you believe in God, who created God? Well, no, no. The definition of God, from our perspective, is the uncreated creator of everything. So when you're asking who created the uncreated creator, that's a silly question. And by the way, you atheists also believe there's an uncreated creator. Creator. Some of you believe it's a quantum environment from which universes emerge. Some of you believe there's some kind of multiverse generator that creates an infinite number of universes. But regardless, whatever you say it is, you believe it's eternal. 